Sometimes I dearly like to play the guitar, but I, I, I haven't got the ability or probably the, the capacity to do it. So I just decided that I have enough with my guitar. See, for a person who hasn't got any discipline, like myself, um, and I'm talking about mental discipline, and, and guitar, it's the thing that excites me, you know, uh, to be able to control um, every aspect to the, to the limit, you know, like a surgeon controls a cat or incision. You know. And to me, it's, it's so complex to tell the hands what you want. I'll do it this way because it really uh, helps me to get what I want from the, the timber and uh, it's, it's rather wasteful but um, I think it's the only way. You, you see the fibres, they're all more or less piled to the ground, to the top and that's what I want.
I have noticed, you know, people, they show certain deference to me, just as a guitar maker, not as a human being, because the majority of them, they don't know me as a human being. They know me through my guitars. I'm proud of one thing, actually. It's the only thing I'm proud of. It's not on my account. It's an account of my father. It's that their Romanigio's name is, is a spread throughout the world, connection with the guitars. And I know that my father would have been very proud. That really gives me nice warmth inside. I do happen to know that when I was a plain carpenter doing work for somebody else, um, nobody wanted to know that Jose Romani just live in Barrick St. James or whatever. But as soon as I got going on my guitars and got my own workshop and all that, the, the attitude changed. Before it didn't relate to it because it was just a plain carpenter and uh, this is the thing you know I mean uh, I got this car so that and I must admit it I, I, I probably have a chip in the shoulder of our life because my well my father and my grandfather they were exploited you know senselessly by, by the system um, my my grandfather used to be a shepherd, you know, they used to sort of hire himself for a whole year and he used to, didn't have any rights or didn't have anything else to sleep in a, in a barn. It wasn't allowed into the proper house of the Lord of the Manor as you were. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.